Well folks, day two. So I was looking for a, I've been driving about forested roads, I was looking for this lock that I've been, I've been told about, but I can't find it. So I found a nice wee riverside location, so I'm going to set up here, get a TP tent up. Obviously this is the second day of a two day trip, so I've been eating donuts and boosts. And so I think it's time to get the TP tent set up. Get the stove on and get some cooking done. So, stay tuned. All set up. I'm gonna uh, get some breakfast on. I'm saying breakfast, it's about lunchtime. But I've got bacon, sausage, eggs, some rolls, a bit of tomato sauce. Mm. So, let's get this stove uh, lit up. Get some oil in the pan and get something to eat. So this is what it's cooking. Ten Cumberland pork sausages, bacon, eggs, Thai scone, tomato sauce, rolls. Mmm. Sausages first. So we might as well stick the five on. I'm doing a wee bit, then we'll get the bacon the eggs and the tie going on. Oh, well. Bacon? Don't mind if I do. Oh, well. Sizzling! It's coming on. Paint for a couple of potato scones. Lovely. And last but not least, a couple of eggs. Not one, but two. Oh, don't want to shell. Oh, never burst one already. Oh, it's looking good. Fantastic. Mm. Oh, I can't wait to tear into this, I'm absolutely ravenous. I think that's good to go. What do you think? Probably for a little bit of good breakfast. It's looking good to me. Right, trying to get these into a couple of rolls, start eating. Oh, feeding time. Right, let's get torn into these bad boys. Taste test. Mm. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, tremendous. Right, I'm going to get torn into these. Sit back, enjoy the sun by the riverside. Just pure enjoy it. But anyway, time to dig in. Oh. Last but not least. Mm. Tremendous. So, nice wee spot. I'm oh, just going to sit, sit back and enjoy the sunshine. Another nice wee spot. Something about that sound of water, isn't there? Well, this is the spot for tonight. Beautiful blue skies again. The big yellow things out. Brilliant. Well, I'm just going to sit and chillax. Must have been quite kind of tired for last night. That walk on yesterday, hot the medic. But it was well worth it. Well worth it for a summit camp. But this one here is going to be a nice, lazy sip of the river. And just chill out. Ah, why not? Cool old feet down. Lovely. 
supposed to be getting the, the kayak at the Dana Loch, but I couldn't find that lock I was looking for, so that's how I ended up here. But I must admit, I really am a knacker, see if that, that trek yesterday. So what I've done is I've just <laughs> I've pulled the I've pulled the inner kind of base. I've actually never used this in the TP, but there's a, a, a full kind of floor that goes inside it. So what I've done is I've just pulled that out, stuck it down in the grass, and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna lie. I'm just gonna lie in the grass, enjoy the sunshine. But it really is, it's an absolute scorcher of a day again. So, like I said earlier, man, I'm just going to have a lazy one. I've got a bottle of wine there, but do you know what way? I can't even bother drinking it. I'm just enjoying just lying in the sunshine. But I did say this is going to be a lazy one today. And that's exactly what it's going to be a lazy one. But I might get back out, I'll maybe do a wee quick overnight or tomorrow night. I might just go up my local hills. Yeah. Might even get the hammock out. Might get my, my Hennessy hammock. Maybe go a wee kind of hill camp. But wait and see. I don't know, I'll go somewhere. But as for the day, like I say, just, just chilling or billing. But sometimes it's good just to have a nice easy one. I knocked my pan in last night climbing up that hill, so I just couldn't be bothered to I'll be, I'll be honest even if I'd found a lock. I feel I feel like tired, I thought I could have been bothered blowing up my kayak. But you never know. And I did when I stopped here I did think about a uh, Blown up, maybe doing a wee section of this river, but those bits are just too shallow, so it's not even worth my while. So, what I'll do is I'll just lie back, maybe get a wee brew on later on, get a wee, wee brew. But for the now, I'm just going to sit and enjoy the sun. So, I'm going to lie back for an hour. I might even fall asleep, who knows. Oof, oh, fell asleep there for about, I don't know, a few hours, just fell asleep outside in the grass. So, oh, I've, been in the, I've been in the sun too long. So I'm going to get in and uh, I'm just going to stick this stove on. I know it's still sunny outside, but I don't know if I've had too much sun. I'm going to you know, get those old shivers because I've had too much sun. So I'm going to get in the tent, put the stove on. Keep myself up. There we go, that's me like it. Time for a brew, I think. So I'm going to let that water boil, uh, we'll have a wee brew, but I can't tell why, I'm still knackered, <laughs> so I think what I'll do is, I'm going to, I'm going to have a brew, I'm not even going to have my wine tonight, I'm literally going to, I'm going to have an early night, but I'm going to have a brew now, watch the sun go down, uh, and then probably hit the sack. So, this video is just going to be a wee short one. Because, like I say, I'm absolutely shattered. So, let's get this water boiled. Get a wee brew to go. And I've still got a couple of, what do you call them, uh, boosts left. I'm still not eating them, so I'll have that with my brew. if it's hot enough deep bag in touch of milk time for a brew 
first time folks oh, you can't be a breath can you cannot beat it so I'm gonna have my brew a very cheeky boost sat and watch the sun, sun go down as it's slowly getting there now and I'm just gonna crash out but it's been a good couple of days can't tell why I've enjoyed it so I'll just spin you around just show you the sun I'll be honest you probably can't make that out it's probably just cancelling out the, the light but you can see the difference in the, the colour it's definitely right in another, maybe another hour and the sun will be going down I'm saying a brew and a boost eh, it's a melted boost it's obviously been sitting in the sun so you know, it's always been the one way done it cheers Oh, I've got to say, got another, another new tent in the way. So, that's a nice one. Uh, not cheap either. Uh, very, very lightweight. I think it only weighs something like 536 grams. It's got a couple of walking poles. Uh, made of Cuban fibre. So, I'm looking forward to getting this one. Uh, I know it's, it's with FedEx in the house, so Hopefully it'll appear in the next few days. Uh, maybe get a camp put in it, probably next weekend. Might do a wee kind of set up video. Why not? Eh? See what it's there. And I'm as well setting it up first. Because it looks a wee bit unusual. Well, I'm saying unusual. But it looks like a good wee... Uh, it does look like a, it's supposed to be a crank tent. Very, very lightweight. Not be the most lightweight tent I've got anyway. So... Don't know if you'd go up the mountain with it, but we'll see what it's like. But as tonight, I'm at the, the Pongley TP, which I can't tell why it's a fantastic tent, especially because you get the wood burning stove on it. It's just really is, it's a brilliant tent. But right now, taking another hour of sunlight, now I'm maybe get out of my bed, crash out. I'll bring you back in later. Well, I'm saying that, I might talk some more dribble, eh, I've got to go to my bed tonight, but I'll wait and see. Eh, well my battery's about to run out, so I don't know where I'll get much more footage. So, if I don't, eh, make sure you give the, the video a wee like, if you don't mind. Hit the subscribe button, hit the bell for future notifications, and thanks for watching, and we'll bring you back in the next one. Which will probably be tomorrow night. <laughs> but can't thank you enough, uh, especially all my subscribers. That's me past the 3,000 mark, so brilliant. But I'll leave you with some photos. Uh, there's plenty of photos. I've got a few photos for the day as well, so hopefully I'll get some nice ones with the sun going down in the tent and that. So, adios, amigos.